is your First Alert 5 weather with Sam Schreier. Good afternoon, everyone. We went weather alert, and you're probably wondering why, because it's been fine. Well, just give me a little while here. It's cold. It's 42 degrees in Colorado Spring with a south wind of 20 miles per hour, and the humidity is not exactly high, but it's not super dry either. So when that wind takes a bit of a more easterly turn, it's going to start running up those slopes. Look at all the cloud cover running into Pikes Peak over Woodland Park. We do have some good moisture in the atmosphere, and it's cold Woodland Park. 37 degrees with Pueblo, more cloud cover in that sky, 47, but there's that east wind that'll be pushing its way into the Arkansas River Valley and over also to the wet mountains, trying to give them some good snowfall. So we're actually seeing rain first, because you gotta remember, this system will be a lot of rain, because it is so what much more above freezing. Good showers are coming in off the Sanga de Cristos and it's actually rain over the top to the point where we will be cautiously watching for some flooding advisories on the spring burn scar. Hopefully we do not get that. The hour by hour, it's been doing okay this morning, but I wish it had had more of that rain down to the south. So basically through the afternoon, this is one o'clock and then we get over towards like two o'clock, those showers become more widespread in the mountains. So one to two, it starts a lot better out west. And then through the end of the day, we start to watch this come on in. 3.30, we've got rain scattered more so to the southern I-25 corridor by three to four. But by five, that's when I'm really expecting a fairly good and at times heavy shower through the springs, Monument, Pueblo, but also well into the mountains. Now, by five and six, we do start to watch Woodland Park and Monument Hill for a snow changeover. But notice by eight o'clock, it's still pretty warm. We will likely have snow falling in Woodland Park, but not really sticking. Past eight o'clock to nine and 10, that's when we really start to get some heavy snow in Woodland Park, Teller County. By midnight or close to it, Monument is beginning to snow, so is Black Forest. And basically through tomorrow morning, and the model accidentally jumped much farther ahead that I wanted, we get that snow to really pile up over the hill. But Monument Hill, don't worry too much. I still do not think you're where the most of the snow is going to go. It's going to be like Pikes Peak itself, Southern Teller County, but just Woodland Park, Teller County in general, will probably see the most accumulation in our region. And if I get a little closer look for you, three to six inches in Cripple Creek around the peak to Woodland Park, two to five, and then Colorado Springs. Most of the city will probably see at least a little snow at some point tonight, but the accumulation is really only going to be to the far northern edge of town. So in your seven day forecast, because most of the things, most of town won't really see any accumulation. I don't even have weather alerts really for the springs. It'd be more Monument Hill, but we will have a rain snow mixture tomorrow morning. Just rain on Tuesday afternoon, and then we're drier towards the weekend. The weekend actually still looks pretty good for the entire region. Pueblo, you're all rain. Rain through the overnight hours, rain tomorrow morning, scattered showers Tuesday afternoon, a few more showers Wednesday, dry through the extended. Pueblo, you're going to get some showers late today and tonight, morning rain tomorrow, isolated rain on Wednesday, 60s turn to 70s and we're dry over the weekend. But Woodland Park, you're going to get snow late tonight. It's going to be rain first, then it'll be snow by tomorrow morning. Watch for slick drives Tuesday and then a rain snow mixture Wednesday and Thursday.